you ready to go? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're streaking! We, Joe, remember? Yeah. <laughs> Remind me to um, trim that bush that's over there. That's, over. that's brutal. We're gonna solidify our range tour today. We've got an all-star cast of human beings. We're gonna go down there, we're gonna do some product reviews, we're gonna get a tour of Manatee, talk about what they've got going on. Then, honestly, with all these guys that I got meeting us down there, we'll figure out when we do scale this out, first statewide and then nationally, what are the competitions that we can do that are fun and kind of entertaining as opposed to a lot of the typical serious sh Look at Zeus, you see him? Zeus. Hey buddy, I appreciate that today, man. Oh my god. You alright? Yeah, 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 yeah. Listen, yeah. we were half waiting for like the ATF to come in and get us because like there's like a who's who of people that are here and we don't even know what's going on. <laughs> exactly. It's pretty, yeah. pretty awesome. It's pretty awesome. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not terribly certain with what it is that I put together here. Honestly, when we pulled up, I thought to myself, the range is supposed to be closed today. And it dawned on me, holy crap, all these people are here to kind of participate in this brainstorm session that we're putting together. Uh, again, not really certain as to how the day is going to go, but I do know one thing. That a lot of ideas die because people are afraid to just put themselves out there and give it a whirl. So I'm going to cross my fingers and hope for the best. Hey, my name is Billy Tutko. Everybody calls me Tank. I'm why. the Senior <laughs> Chief Range Safety Officer out here at Manatee Gun and Archery Club. I've got the gun rider with me here today. We're going to go and uh, explore the range. The pistol bays, we've got them Old West right now. Uh, honestly, the way that the plan looks right now is that this all will be the thousand. Okay. So these pistol bays will no longer exist in the current form that they are. I would like to have about eight pistol bays. Or four like this, which I, I'd say they're roughly 25 by 25, I don't know, 30 by 30. I'd like to have four that are about this size and four that are about double the size. And like this is the second bay. This is when, and I'm gonna tell you when I instruct for my company, this is the bay I get. The thing that's great about that on the line is, is I'm here Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So I get to know everybody. There's continuity. It's not like a group of guys that are running Thursday and Friday, and then there's a different group of guys running Saturday and Sunday, and they don't talk to each other at all. Right. I bring that certain level of, of like, le like level, <laughs> you know, continuity to it. So this is a 600 bench rest, and essentially, if you look at it this way. The 600, uh, the targets there are, are overhangs here, and then it goes straight down. So it would essentially, we'd wipe that all out, yeah. and it, this would be the thousand. Yeah. This is 51 alpha right now, which would essentially turn into the 600. We'd push that berm back to be even with the 600 berm. Then we could do a three next to it, and then we can push the 51. I love 51 now, it's great. We have a 25 yard pistol right there, berm. Then you have the left lateral berm, and then you have the back berm, which is 150 yards from the... Yes. The sky's the limit right now. We're, we're consistently trying to do things, consistently trying to make it better, and it's just, uh, you know, everyone's gonna have to, you know, stay flexible. Uh, Simper Gumby, stay flexible. My name's Danny Alvarez. Mutiny Arms. We're with Mutiny Arms. Today we are at uh, Manatee Rod and Gun. Nope. What's it called? Manatee Gun and Archery Club. Everybody, Danny Alvarez with Shane Henderson here from Mutiny Arms. We are super, super excited to be displaying our brand new weapons, our 9mm ARs here at the uh, Manatee Gun Club in great old Manatee County, Florida. Shane, tell us a little bit about what you're holding. We got our uh, billet version of our 9mm pistol. We fill it upper and lower. Um, stainless Odin Works barrel, um, pretty much all the good stuff in this model. Um, Anti-safety, everything. We 
We've got our other model here that's a forged version. Um, this is more of our base model. Um, we can upgrade these as you want. When I was talking to you guys and, and trying to understand a little bit more about the company that I understood that stood out was, um, I think DJ, one of your partners said, uh, he wants to treat customer service as if the house was on fire. So if there's a problem, Correct. everyone in the company stops as if the house was on fire. We treat our customers as we would our friends. We're just using top end quality parts from well known name manufacturers, trying to put everything together as you know, with quality parks instead of these Chinese knockoff stuff that everybody likes to use nowadays. You know, uh, I noticed something uh, on this weapon and this is like really, really cool. Instead of uh, safe and fire, the saying is peace, bang, mutiny. So Danny and uh, Shane from Mutiny Arms, we're uh, super proud to be here. Thank you for having us. And we hope you learned a little bit more about us. Hey guys, my name is Charlie Gaudier. I'm with the Grizzly Targets and we're doing the range tour right now. I've been shooting for about 10 years now. Uh, I've been on the pro level for the last four. I started at uh, pro level in IDPA, in the SSP, ESP. So I've been with Grizzly Targets for the last three years. That's the man right there. Quick draw McGraw, Grizzly Targets, Manatee County. And Grizzly Target has been a very important part of my training program. I use all your steel, uh, but this is the one that I like the most because this is an Alpha and Charlie zone uh, only. Uh, you get immediate feedback of your shots and you don't have to pay. So your training goes a lot smoother when you're using targets like this. And as you can see, targets are a little bit banged up but it's still holding strong. I also like the fact that it's a 45 degree angle so you can actually get close to the target and you don't have that problem of uh, ricochet in your back. Guys, stay tuned for Grizzly Targets Range Tours. We're gonna have a lot of cool things to show you guys. We're gonna have giveaways, we're gonna have new products, we're gonna show you a bunch of new ranges and a bunch of cool people. So we're gonna have a blast. Stay tuned, guys. Hey everyone, this is Gary with T1 Ammunition. We're out here today at Manatee Gun and Archery. And we're out here to support Grizzly Targets and Mutiny Arms. We're out here getting some range time today, checking out the targets, making sure everything's working properly and having a great time. So T1 Ammunition is the official loader for uh, Team Glock, so we're very proud of that. We're also the official ammo for 511 Tactical. All right guys, Bob Keller from Gamma Resolutions. I'm out here with Grizzly Targets. And you left again. <laughs> yeah, like, I have no idea how to wrap up. Jeremy! out at uh, Manatee Gun and Archery Club. So, Gamma Resolution, if you don't know, I uh, provide shooting instruction. Uh, that's anywhere from straight up beginners that have never shot before, all the way up to the, the most advanced in the tactical shooting. So not only in my classes, I'm huge on the paper targets. Not only with the paper targets, I shoot dots, right? Three inch dots, six inch dots. Gotta do it. Uh, once you get that dialed in to where that is your norm, well then you have to incorporate steel. Grizzly targets from what I've seen are the best around. Alright, so that's why I use these suckers. Usually what I use are the IP6 style uh, plates. So the range tour concept is kind of supposed to provide an entire platform for the ranges, for individuals, for the manufacturers, for people that want to come and participate in it. Grizzly will benefit regardless from all of this. We're building something that's much bigger than the company itself in an attempt to kind of branch out and grab people's attention. That being said, there's a point in every meeting where it's time to stop talking and get to work. Hey. This went good though, man. You know, everybody had a good time. Targets held up phenomenal as usual. It's nice and smooth. Shot everything that we had at them. This guy just took a royal beating. When I say we make some of the best targets in the country, Really not everybody had a good time all the ideas are set now for the most part it's gonna work man everybody came out and everybody had a blast and that's really you know that's what I'm trying to do with this whole entire thing not even just the range tour but the company in general is make it's our company makes your experience better right so oh man I'm tired how about you yeah <laughs> all right yeah, let's yeah. go